Hello, hello, and welcome back for part 12 of the Growing Together with the O'Brien's Legacy Challenge. I'm Amber, and in today's episode, we are going to enjoy the fact that our quads are now children. I'm so excited and so incredibly happy because y'all, them infant and toddler days were kicking my butt. And it was just entirely too much going on. So we finally have four kids in the game. So in my mind, I'm believing that they're probably around, oh, I don't know, maybe like six, seven years old. And so they will probably act like it. As you saw in the last episode, if you watched it, they had some pretty interesting traits and they are all very different. Um, Sarai ended up being diagnosed with, um, I think it was autism. And so I've never had that happen in my Sims game. So that's gonna be really interesting to kind of deal with and play through. And then, um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Obviously they moved into a new apartment, so we're kind of dealing with that. It is still Friday in the game. I didn't play any off camera. The only thing that I did was go ahead and give my babies makeovers. So Miss Sarai is down here in the freaking sauna, I believe. I don't know why, but I think she is. Um, this is her now. Um, what a huge improvement because they were all just toe up from the flow up and now they are all looking very very adorable so that's miss sarai who has always been our kind of like mean baby and then here is jace i'm still repping the blue for him to try and kind of tell him and kellen apart so this is jace now and then here is miss mariah she's actually getting into bed this is miss mariah this is not a very flattering picture of her. She she would make it seem like, really, Mariah. <laughs> I was just talking about how I gave them makeovers and made them look so much better. And then here she is sitting here looking weird in the eyes with her jagged edge teeth. Like, nice. It just couldn't be perfect, could it? <laughs> She's still pr primarily repping yellow so that I can tell her apart from Sarai. And then last but not least is Kellen. And Kellen is going to be wearing more red than anything so I can tell him and Jace apart. So um, yeah, and he was our like neat sim. So I tried to give him a hairstyle that I felt like a neat sim would have. It's very precise and clean. So I thought that that was fitting for him. And yeah, I did also give Skye a few more outfits. Um, I didn't give her an actual makeover makeover yet in terms of like changing her hair and stuff. Um, but maybe we can do that in this episode. Maybe have her go and get a new hairstyle and do her nails or something. It might be kind of fun. So it's still Friday and they're eating on their birthday cake. Also, I'm gonna go ahead and have her resume this steak that she paid 60 freaking simoleons for. And, um, oh, I can actually cook on this cookbook? I must have a mod for that. That's cool. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and let her cook that, although she's not hungry, just so that I can store it in the fridge. Um, not Kellen being bored. Okay, we'll come upstairs. Mariah's Aww. like, I don't care what my siblings are doing, I'm going to bed. Why is Jay so tense? At least he's washing his dishes, but I see now I'm going to have to set these. Set sink type, bathroom. Yay! And this one will be the one for our kitchen. Okay, so wait. He's tense because he's neurotic. Okay. And he's feeling a little off from something. Oh, God. Don't tell me he's sick. Please, y'all just aged up. Ew, yucky. Oh, I kind of forgot that Sarai was our picky eater, too. So, oh. Girl, she's just gonna be interesting to deal with all the way around. Mariah overall is doing pretty good, so at least that's one of them. What did she even cook? What is this? Steak tartare, girl? Fulfill order, we can make money for that? Okay, put it away though. The babies can eat that later. Did that help with her? Okay, it did. 
we took today off but i might actually have her go ahead and go to work actually no it's so late she's already missed so many hours and last time she went she came back with like 17 freaking simoleons which was ridiculous why are they hanging out in the bathroom sarai what is she doing yeah. i'm gonna put the walls down because it makes it a little easier for me um you know what we're gonna do we're gonna call chits now that we can slow down a little bit she was inviting us over and stuff like that in the last episode oh my god i kind of forgot to fix cody and then i think what we'll have her do she's got some free time and she needs some fun the babies oh what is all this stuff in her inventory what is that Oh, in the store. she's got sausage it's croissants? Yeah, it's a verb. Oh, That's crazy. What is that? Okay, let's have them all do their homework just so that it's done. Have they had these croissants in their freaking inventory since we moved out of the first house? Because if so, that is wild. She's got freaking cornflakes. Like, what? Do homework. Okay, those are spoiled. This crowbar. They better Ugh. take care of them freaking selves. Hold on, let me check my settings real quick. So I double checked all of that and we are good. A trash or sink is required. We have both? Oh, I'm confused. Okay. I don't like that our babies are just coming and going. Oh my gosh, Sarai's eyes are bothering Flick. her. <sighs> Why is he standing outside in a towel? Wow. Jace, what? What is he doing? Mariah is up, but why is she dazed? Oh, still from her low energy. Why are they down here doing their homework? I love that they're doing it all together though. I do like that part. Well, except freaking Jace. Jace is like, you guys can do whatever you want. <laughs> oh, I like, oh, I was talking crap about him and there he goes. Oh, look at all of my babies. Oh, Stevie. See no glove. Look at all of them doing their homework. I hate that Mariah is so dazed. Oh. Well, while they're down there doing that, girl, stop crying. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Let's make her a dating profile or something. It's time, you know, she's not living with Kyle anymore or anything. Like, let's, let's actually, let's do something fun for her. Check for invites. Gamble at the casino is crazy. Yeah, let's create a fruity sim profile. Oh. Huh? The way these boobs are sitting, girl, you need to be out and about. Hello? Edit profile. Okay, great. The Fruity Sim app offers you four types of relationships. Banana for spicy and one night stands. Oh no, I don't really think we're looking for that right now. Cherry for Sims who wanna chat peacefully before getting serious. Peach means you want a strictly platonic relationship and orange means you're looking for something serious. Ooh, I don't know, what do we want for her? Because I feel like she should be just kind of like having fun, especially after dealing with everything with Cody. I don't feel like she should be looking for anything super, super serious right now. But I also don't think that she would be the type who like wants spicy one night stands. So maybe let's do Cherry. She just wants to chat peacefully before getting serious. Let's do Cherry. So we did that. And what is this? Losing control because of her unfulfilled dreams. Girl, I'm trying to get you promotions at work and stuff. Like what more do you want from me? Um choose type of relationship okay so i guess now we just wait until something comes from that um let's see what else were we supposed to do i was supposed to apply for benefits um ooh. can we do all of them denied 
Why? Because we have 10,000 simoleons now? That's poop. Um, summer break. It's break time. Jace's school is out for summer break unless his or her parents want to keep him in school for summer school. Yeah, no, they're going to summer school for sure. <laughs> they are definitely going. Um, who is this? Congratulations on your recent birthday, Dad. Please. How about instead of just calling and saying congratulations, you actually come and like spend time with us or something, you know? Just saying. What is this? <gasps> Become a foot model? Can we make money? I mean, her feet aren't hideous, but she's gonna need some freaking <laughs> toenail polish and stuff. We're just doing everything now. She's like, my kids have aged up. I wanna get involved in everything. I wanna go on dates. I wanna become a foot model. We need to go get her on birth control though, because I swear to goodness, if she ends up pregnant, I'm gonna be so upset. Yo, uh, I also need to do that laundry. <laughs> so like, did it work? <laughs> Search pockets and then do laundry. Girl, did it work? Are you a foot model? Post a picture of your feet? Yes, girl, yes. We need to go, oh, good job, Kellen. We need to go and get our feet done. Oh, she can create an Only Sims account. Okay, that's taking a little too far, I think. Thirst traps and stuff, girl. Call sadness hotline. Maybe we should do that. Can they help us stop being freaking sad? Try it, girl, give it a try. Cause you need some help. Camera, fashion student. Virtual school? Yes! Get bikini wax. Um, I was going to send her to get on birth control so she has some money. She got 12 followers. Would you say that Kellen and Sarai have a difficult family dynamic? They'll be mean to each other more often, can easily become bitter with each other and intentionally neglect social calls. Sure, whatever. I'm just kind of letting the game decide whatever it's gonna be between them. Cause there's too many of them for me to like <laughs> take care of it all 100% myself. Sarai is feeling productive, that's good. Um, Yeah, we are going to go to the doctor. Let's go to the gyno. Okay. Mariah's coming up to go to bed. Jace is still in a mood, walking around in a freaking towel. What is he trying to do? Change into robe? Boy, if you don't get upstairs in the house, you need to go and grab grab a piece of cake or something. Oh, we got 120 simoleons? I'm assuming that's for her and work. Yay! That's the first time she's actually Summer camps are where the fun happens when it's summertime and children want to get away, spend time with friends and make new ones and parents want to send their kids out for a while. Sign up today. Yes. Sure. Um, Choose either day camp or away camp. Away camp and day camp both last five days. Oh my goodness. Um, Let's do... Ooh. Let's do away camp. Is it just him? I kind of want all of them to do it. That probably sounds really bad because I literally just <laughs> aged them up, but whatever. Um, Can I choose to cancel that at any time? He's got class in three days. Sign up for camp. Oh my gosh, that costs 500 simoleons? Nope, I changed my mind. Oh my gosh, it went through? Hello? Bruh. Well, hell. Um, baby girl, you need a shower. Can you please get up here and take a shower and pee? Well, Mariah, that's why you're so sleepy, baby. You're napping. You need to go to sleep, sleep. So you can stop being freaking dazed. Kellen is going upstairs to eat something, although, oh, he's cleaning up. I was about to say, he's not even hungry. Is Sky interested in a copper IUD? Yes. 
I don't know how much that's gonna cost and I don't care. I am not gonna <laughs> risk it. So she's good now. Zombo. Perfect. Ugh. Girl, I told you to get up here and use the bathroom. What are you doing? What is Sarai doing? Girl, you are brown and funky. Please go use the bathroom. Oh my gosh. Oh, good. Oh, <gasps> wait, what? Her visit went fine, but her blood work and smear did show that she has a woohoo transmitted infection. How? Okay, wait, which one is it? Because one said that something did and one said that it didn't. Because I'm sitting here like, how? She's not done anything with anybody. What? Okay, so she's disease free. Okay, good. So that one is just wrong. I don't know what that one's talking about. She's good because she hasn't been messing around. So that's good. Disease free. Sky's completely free of WTDs. Good to know. Yay. She's still feeling bad about breaking up and stuff. So that's kind of annoying. But she's back now and apparently on birth control and stuff. So that's good. There should be something here that says that. Mm. So normally... There's a thing that comes up here that says that they have an IUD. I don't see it here. That's weird. Why isn't it there? And it also doesn't show it here. If this game is trying to trick me into messing around with people and she gets pregnant, I'm going to be so pissed. <laughs> you have no idea. Cause it's literally not here and it should be. So that's weird. Um, I guess we can double check that in a second. Where is he going? Oh my gosh. Kellen. No, now you're gonna clean it up. He went all the way upstairs just to make a mess. No, clean it up. He needs some fun. Yeah. He should definitely watch some TV. Is Sarai good? Okay, she's in the shower. What's going on out here? They were just standing there? Oh, okay. I thought it was one of those weird scenarios or something happening outside. It's 7 p.m. She's feeling decent. Girl, no, that is not your bed. Okay, I see, I'm gonna have to do this. So the red is for you, assign bed to Kellen. Assign this one to Jace. Assign this one to Sarai and assign this one to Mariah. And then mommy, your bed is down here. Why would you go all the way upstairs to get in that bed is insane. Like literally. I wish her energy was up more. I would have let her go out tonight. Let's go have her take like a little nap or something. It's a Friday night. We're gonna let her go out. She needs just a little bit of rest first. Cause the kids are definitely good. They don't need us at all. Girl, why is her energy not going up? Hello? Okay, there we go. Took her a minute to go to sleep, I guess. What is Jason here doing? <gasps> Hello? Who is this? Why is this Sean Willis person in my... What is wrong with his face? And why is he in my room? And where are his pants? Um, no? He literally just walked in my house to say hi? No, absolutely not. Nope, you already know what we're about to do. Y'all already know what we're about to do. I'm not finna start this with them. No, stop him. Damn it, he's leaving so I can't stun him. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. Okay, well she's up now. So let's have her go, Um, let's have her shave and stuff. Oops. Let's have her shave and stuff and then 
we are going to have her go out. Girl, it's fine. Let him go. I don't understand whatever that witness was. Wait, why is Sarai crying? Feeling hurt from someone nearby. Girl, what? Why does Jace have the mischief skill now? Is he the mean one? Because one of them was like mean or something. No, it's not him. So it must have been uh, Kellen. Yeah, Kellen is the mean one. Sarai, girl, eat something then. Like, have whatever that is. I don't even know what it is, but have it. Oh, it's cereal. Cause one thing about Mariah, she gonna get her sleep, okay? I'm not mad at it. Oh good, we did bring our vacuum cleaner. Girl, stop crying. Well, I was trying to just put this down, but it's all up in the way. I'm about to say, where is he putting that damn plate? She can eat while she's out. What is this? Breath conscious? Okay, so we'll let her do that. Wait, what? This guy is staying true to all her loved ones. Okay, girl, brush your teeth and then we're going out. We'll invite Chit too, hurry up. They never brush their teeth for long. Um, let's... We're gonna travel. Yep, we're inviting Chit. We're not gonna invite anybody else. Actually, let's invite Penny too. Yay, they're coming, awesome. Um, so I think everywhere that I put down here in Newcrest is just like places to eat for when she goes on like her little dates. And I did a splash water park here as well so that like her and the kids can go maybe sometime this weekend and a gym. So we're gonna have to find somewhere else to go party. Okay, <clears throat> I don't really know anything about this place. Oh, hold on. I don't even think this place has like a dance floor. Like what? How is this an up and coming hot spot and like we can't even dance? Like what do you mean? Why, cause it's got a little VIP place upstairs? I do not care, hold on. Okay, so boom, I put down a dance floor and a DJ booth as well. So I'm gonna need for a DJ person to get up in here and get it popping. So somebody's coming and then we'll be able to dance and stuff. Me and the girls are gonna go in here and dance anyways, like come on. Oh, who are these random people? I hope we find somebody tonight, that'd be so fun. Oh, hold on, only Penny came? Where's, oh no, only Chick came. Penny did not come? Okay, well, that's okay. Me and Chick can have a good time by ourselves. We don't need Penny pizzazz. Oh, oh, get it girl. Get it, girl, there's no music playing and she's still just gonna kill it. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Her and shit are getting it. Get it, girls. Get it, not Judith Ward trying to pay attention to our steps. <laughs> okay, Judith. She would be dancing like a princess. Okay, girl. Me and Chick killing it right now. We definitely about to be best friends. <laughs> I love this so much. <laughs> I want to talk to her. No, don't stun her. Oh my god. Oh, there. Okay. They are serious. Oh, oh, not the MC Hammer dance. <laughs> I don't think they're doing the right dance moves to this. Can I not change what type of music? I guess not. Okay, who is this? Guadalupe 
Berrigan? What about this place is up and coming? There's nobody here. Y'all, I told y'all to stop dancing. Why are they still dancing? Oh, who are you? Tori. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I might have to like reset them. There we go. Okay. Oh, who are you? Adriana. Ben Benel whatever. I don't know what her last name is. But let's talk to her. We need more friends. Oh, you're hungry. I got you. Just give me one second. Friendly compliments. Compliment her personality for sure. What is that? I'm Angelo. <laughs> I'm hello. Wow, what a sim. Sky O'Brien just stopped what they were thinking about for a moment and found themselves staring at him. I just said his name. That man has so many of the qualities that make Sky's heart race as if it were on a cross country marathon. Their handsome features meet Sky's desires so readily that it's almost as if whatever created such a sim sculpted him specifically for Sky. Okay. Sure, girl. Let's go say hi. You're very sad, though, so I don't think this is going to um, really work, but sure. Go give him a friendly introduction. I'm not filling them glasses, but I mean, whatever you like, I guess. Hold on, let's turn down this set volume. Did she say hi? I think she did. With your back turned is crazy, girl. Peter Gaines. Friendly compliments. No, just um interest. Discuss interest. And who are you? Oh, that's Thorn Bailey. Yeah, no, that's not gonna work out in our favor at all. I wish she would stop sitting with her back turned to him while she's supposedly talking to him, because what sense does that make? Oh my goodness, it's like 1.30 in the morning. It's a good thing she doesn't work tomorrow. Girl, what is it that you're seeing about him? Cause I mean he's not horrible, but I'm not really seeing whatever you're seeing. Uh -huh. Let me see. What does this say? Oh, God. Okay, so she thinks that he's extremely attractive and they have amazing compatibility, but their first impressions are not good. She thinks that he's immature and he thinks that she's clingy. Ah, Bob. That's interesting. They have amazing compatibility, though, so we might want to take a look into that. Oh, how does she have good first impressions with Adriana, but not with Angelo? It's crazy. Aw, and they have good compatibility. <laughs> what was her compatibility like with Chit? Oh, they don't have any, okay. Oh, there's Penny, she was just late to the party. Hey, girl. She's like, sorry, I'm so late. Not her ordering a drink. She's like, girl, it has been a day. Oh, she's only here because of Thorn Bailey. Penny ain't fooling nobody. She's like sort of talking to them, but not really. Can we get a drink? Girl, I want you to order a drink. Oh crap, I clicked off of it. The drink is not gonna help the fact that she's hungry, but whatever. Not them with their phones up. Okay, yeah, ooh, I want a Bahama Mama. Absolutely. Please and thank you. And Fabi Narble Fraud. Oh cool, it's just in her inventory. Bet. Drink that thing, girl. Drink it. Babarani Zimze. It's so little and cute. Uh, Why is she looking at this guy with the red eyes? And what happened to the freaking DJ? Are they closing or something? I don't know, that's right, girl. Down it. Who is this with the... Oh, a new DJ, Jalen. Okay. 
Is he a young adult or an adult? He's a young adult. Oh, one of them. Who is this man yeah. throwing Bailey hugging up on? If I tried that, it would not have worked out so well for me. Like, please be so for real. Oh, she's talking to this guy now? Who is he? What is his name? Well, he is a part of the conversation, but apparently we haven't actually met him. That's the Tory guy. Might as well give him a friendly introduction since he's a part of the conversation. Would you like to go on vacation? It's crazy. Hey, Talk about news. Finos Girl, no, yeah. please. Activity. What? Bruh, Bruh, we're at the club. Wasn't he just sitting here? We were just sitting here together. What did he do? Go straight to the bathroom? Like, please be frugal. Oh, I was just talking about how this place wasn't hitting on nothing, and then Thorn Bailey showed up, and now everybody and their mama is here. He likes video gaming. Okay, that's cool. Girl, finish your drink. Interest. You seem like you were interested, so I'm trying to help you out, girl. Nuh-uh. I told her to discuss interests and can I have some money? That's crazy. We're gonna ask him how how he's doing. Girl, if you don't, did she finish her drink? Oh my god, let me have her go use the ah, sir. I was gonna let her go use the bathroom, but apparently somebody is in there. Is that the only bathroom? She's not gonna be able to use that one because that one is in the VIP place. So he's just gonna have to stop being a weirdo so we can go use the bathroom. Not him continuing with us right there. Bro, he has no shame. Insane. She's drunk? Girl, you have one drink. I know it's been a while, but really? Not her needing to throw up in the middle of the floor. Sky, no! Oh my god! She legit just threw up in the middle of the club. <laughs> she just threw up in the middle of the club. That is crazy. Well, now she's just feeling tipsy, so there you go. That is wild. She's bored with the music? Oh no. I'll be happy when these sad things go away. Did Chit and Penny leave? I think so, because I don't see them anymore. We're going to go home after seeing the guy messing with himself in the bathroom. I think we're done. <laughs> and honestly, she should be embarrassed for puking on, on the freaking floor. And it's 5 a.m. We are not cut out for this anymore. It is hype in there now, though. Okay, cool. We're back home. And it's funny that it's still dark here at 5 a.m., but it was like bright at 5 a.m. over at uh, in Del Sol. So we're gonna let her go ahead and go to sleep. The kiddos are awake. Kellen is over here on the computer. Mariah is upstairs looking in the mirror. We'll let her practice dancing. Talk like a pirate day. <laughs> and Jace is going outside to play on the monkey bars at 6 a.m. Jace, really? All right. And Sarai is sad and going to cry, I believe. We need to get her something to um, like color with and be artistic with. Cause she's our creative baby. She needs, um, we can claim those bikes even though they're not ours. That's wild. Actually, why don't you go outside and play hopscotch with Mariah, Jace, and Kellen. All of you go play. Is she gonna go? 
Yeah, she is. Or I must wait for her turn. She's not going though. I don't know why not. Okay, we'll just have her watch then. I don't really know what happened there. It glitched out though. So the babies are gonna go outside and play. So we're going to just speed this up here. <laughs> Actually, I think we'll just go ahead and in this particular episode here. We did meet a few new people, so that was fun. We got to go out and stretch our legs a little bit. We even had a drink. Um, It's time for Jace to go away to camp. He will return home in five days or when summer ends. Let's just let him go to day camp instead. I kind of wish I didn't do that be honest um but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and end this one here we had a little bit of fun i still can't believe that she puked <laughs> in the middle of the freaking dance floor um but i mean i guess she's getting back used to the partying lifestyle so um with that being said i hope you enjoyed the video if you did make sure you leave a like comment and subscribe show your girl a little love and until next time positive vibes and french fries bye